Hello, my name is Vikas Munjal. This course is about understanding execution plans and index concepts. It is not only sufficient to learn how to develop T-SQL commands, but one should also learn how these commands are executed internally by SQL Server. That you can see using execution plan. In this course, I will explain you how to read and understand these execution plans. I will explain you many operators used in execution plan like nested loop, table spool, segment, compute, scalar, stream aggregate, sort, cluster index seek, key lookup, assert, constant scan, semi joins, etc. There are many operators in the execution plan. So in this course, I will explain you these operators. These execution plan will help you in tuning T-SQL commands. Also in job interview, questions based on execution plans can be asked. I have also explained index concepts in the beginning of the course. So you should not have any issue in understanding execution plans because execution plans use index concepts a lot. Like here, if you see cluster index seek is used, index seek is used, key lookup is used, non-clustered, clustered. So all these things are using the indexing concepts. That is why I have explained these indexing concepts in the beginning of the course. This course is not for beginners. One should have a good understanding of writing SQL commands. So if you are a beginner into this technology, I have other related T-SQL courses on Udemy like beginning T-SQL for SQL Server Developer, Data Analyst and DBA. Another course is T-SQL Training with Real World Scenarios, Tricks of the Trade. So, I will recommend you to do at least uh, first one or two courses before enrolling into this particular course. This course is about understanding execution plans. There are a lot of operators in execution plan which use indexes concept such as index seek, index scan, key lookup, etc. So that is why I have included index concepts in the beginning of the course so that you get the idea about indexes like what is clustered index what is non cluster index and other details in indexes like uh, composite index included columns preferred data types used for creating clustered indexes also what is fragmentation fill factor how to rebuild or reorganize the indexes so all these details will be covered in the beginning of the course. Then I will start with the introduction to execution plan and will explain you what is the difference between actual execution plan and estimated execution plan along with statistics concept. Then I will cover the operators which are most commonly used in the execution plan like what is table scan, index scan, index C, key lookup, row ID lookup, nested loop, sorting, merge join, hash join. So you perform a join operation, but internally SQL server may use merge join, hash join or nested loop. So those operations can be used in solving the join command. You write a group by command, but internally it can use either stream aggregate or hash aggregate. So all these things you will be going to understand. Then there are more common operators like uh, you know about only join, but internally you may see semi join, anti semi join. So, what is left anti semi join, right anti semi join. So, all these things will be covered. Then, more operators like segment, sequence, project. Then, spool will be covered. What is lazy spool? What is eager spool? Then, if suppose the command is having a high cost then it will go for parallelism means multiple processors will be used to solve a single command. So 
into parallelism i will explain you what is distribute stream what is gather stream what is repartitioning stream so all these concepts will be covered in this course then i will cover more topics on execution plan like what is halloween problem then i will explain you all kind of operation like insert update delete operations and i will show the execution plans related to that what do you mean by subtree cost how the subtree cost is related with the parallelism i will explain you that then i will also show you that uh, index supports wildcard characters then you see at the end of the course i will explain you some patterns to observe when you look at the execution plan so that you can tune your sql commands the important points to keep in mind related to merge join hash join key lookup sort aggregate parallelism etc i will also show you what kind of warnings you see in the execution plan also i will explain you parameter sniffing concept and uh, in sql server 2022 a new concept is introduced which is known as parameter sensitive plan optimization so all these things i will be going to cover in this particular course 